Right, so Ferrari just released their 2022 F1 car, and yes, the livery looks awesome, the car as a whole looks awesome, but there's one weird thing we need to talk about. And it's their side pods. I know this has been a big thing we've spoken about with a number of cars this year, them all taking very different options to the same thing, but Ferrari's is perhaps the weirdest. So we've got some footage of the cars here and take a look at this. So they've got these scooped out side pods and the reasoning for that is really quite cool. But first, let me tell you about the McLaren and the Aston because they did some cool things too. So the McLaren had a much skinnier rear end, but then had this exhaust outlet that ran right to the back of the car. Now this is for airflow through the inside of the car. You've got radiators in there for all sorts of things engine cooling, oil cooling, intercooler, all of that sort of thing. And the air needs somewhere to go. So McLaren exit this right at the back of the car above the beam wing. Aston Martin then took a different approach by having these louvres on the top of the side pods. And Ferrari have done something kind of similar, but where they're directing the air once it leaves these louvres is pretty cool. So they've scalloped out the side pods to create this curved surface, which then funnels air over the rear of the car. Now this is really cool. It takes this hot air that's come out of these louvres from the radiators and creates this curved surface funneling it inwards and over that beam wing at the rear. Now we know this year the beam wing is going to be really important for creating downforce as well as the top half but this is where a lot of the teams are sending that hot exhaust air from the radiators out of the back of the car. They do this a, to create downforce, but also B, this hot air can disrupt the aerodynamics over the rear of the car. So they're making sure to deal with this neatly. And that's really cool. This Ferrari is such a cool solution. We had to make a quick video about it. Thank you very much for watching. Check out these other videos explaining the 2022 cars and we'll catch you in the next one.